about that there. Uh, also, yo, damn. Uh, I think it was them. My dad's making something. Huh? I don't know then. Um, yo, Jam, thank you for the resub there, though. I appreciate that. Also, hello, Yobex. Clerk love. Yeah, Jam. Ah. Anyways, uh, let me see here. I'm gonna try getting into this basement. If I can. If I have her go chat with this guy. The dwarf reaches into a barrel and pulls out a fish. His knife gl Wait, can he see? No way. How does he see all the way back there still? Don't spot me. <sighs> Thievery level too low. Do I have anybody with that high of a thievery? I know somebody has it. Wait, where is it? Talents. He has one. The innards fall to the floor, landing in a pool of dark bile. You'd expect fit. Aye, oh, the coin's sweet and the smell sure it. Your clap on the back. Lucky ain't the word I'd use. The dwarf turns back to his work, slicing and disemboweling fish oh. after fish as the blood and looking at the back. Here. So, okay. What was her, uh, thievery? Hers is one as well. Wait. The dwarf seems more in. The dwarf seems more interested in. All right, so let me try giving the lock picks to Ethan. E Lock. Oops. Bell too low. Ah. That's the only way in, right? Yeah. Okay. Oops. Can you try going to the left here again? Um, because last time, I mean, it, we didn't find any type of marker. Maybe if we go up here, there might be a marker or so. Oh no, that turn. Okay, good, good. Because otherwise I think there's uh, source dogs on the, up here. Actually, we can try going up this way. Eh.
Yeah, run past them. But did I ever tell you of my past in the divine order? Oh. Ifan looks uneasy. Even ever tell you I worked with Lucian. Fact is, I was Whoa. once pretty high up in his divine order. He was a good man. He was. And trust me, the divine order of today has nothing to do with Lucian's. Everything, everything started to go downhill during the war after my last mission. He closes his eyes as he speaks. You know sacrifices had to be made during the war? Well, Lucian knew he needed to use Death Fog to eliminate the Black Ring. But doing I was to hurry through the forests with a rift portal for the elves. So they're trying, isn't it? And I won't rest until I know why Lucian. Anyway, let's keep moving. Interesting. I like how, they, how he shared that. Okay. Try going up this way. They're really just not going to follow. can't see what level they are. 13. Oh boy. I know they don't want to walk through it, but kind of have to. level 13 person's level 13 also oh. a haughty looking undead woman what side do you take her voice is clipped and detached with metallic overtones it even seems to echo as if she's speaking to you from very far away she cocks her skull to one side with a nightmarish creak. Though her shiny visage is... Com Quick now, quickly. Do you support Divine Order or Black Ring? Blame me with Divine Order. Long may Dallas triumph. Tell her remember that you only support yourself. Sniff and say that you support neither. Both sides are as bad as each other. Black never goes out of style. Of course you support the ring. Ah, indeed. Malevolence, darkness. It hangs off you like an ill-fitted... I cannot suffer you. Oh, God. We just met, and you're already going to attack me? Interrupted, damn it. Why do I do this to myself? Prepare yourself.
Damn. Almost dead. I mean, they chose to fight us. There it is. They're also close to leveling up. How did I level up though? What the? That is a giant ass troll. What? I don't think I should be up this north. <laughs> I mean, I can try talking with it. Troll is mean to me. Oh wait, there's a spirit. The spirit peers up at you intently. The trolls. Do you know a fascinating thing about trolls? I know all of them. I can tell you anything you need to know about trolls. My life's almost every single troll I encountered in my life. Bunch of ways to do this bridge. I think I don't think I'm even like leveled enough to do this area. Imagine, but of course, every specimen has their own quirks, their own. Petty foibles, and I pushed my curiosity. To, I know, right? I mean, what else should occupy a life as well? No, that's just what the troll is like. Ah, oh, okay. She has no more time for. You don't have to be level. Why not think big? Guy leveled up, and you haven't updated your stats. True. Yeah, I, I kind of want to like wait. Like, uh, I guess I can do mine. Like, look how close this is. Look how close it is in the bottom right. You can probably barely see it, but I'm like almost there for all of them. <laughs> Let's try how chatting. About you back up and try back off, pigeon. This is my The enormous, unusually red troll looms over you with his fists oh. clenched threateningly. His expression is stern, yet you can see the tiniest twinkle in his intelligent eyes. Didn't hear me the first time, Parrot. Shuffle from Toto to and apologize for intrusion. Tell him you're not used to taking insults from walking rocks. He smiles a jagged and magnanimous grin. Each pitchfork pointed tooth seems to threaten you individually. We'll see. You want to cross my bridge? A pretty taxpayer coin constructed that bridge. Side eyeing the dead void woke and say you don't want to end up like that. Not an S to cross the bridge. Well, I killed them. Nobody crosses <laughs> my bridge for free, and they didn't pay the toll. He reminds me of the uh the thing from uh Find you. Mass Effect. They I can't remember the gargons or whatever. With. Something with a G. Pockets for coin, but still, a troll must stand by his principles. <laughs> Escal's principles mesh with extorting money for the use of a public Look bridge. At this wreck. No taxpayer coin. He kicks the edge of the bridge, sending a sizable chunk of rock Roll flying tall. perilously close to your eye. I'm the only thing standing between this bridge and the void. These days, everything is in decline. He rubs his leathery hands together with glee. <laughs> sure, sure. What? One regular prized bridge crossing coming. And I don't want to hear any whiny little <laughs> baby noises about it either. Try a rep and cut through him if you have to. Ask him if there's anything you do. Tell him that he'd be better charging less since more people could cross this way. Oh my god, you need five? Oh god. I think not. Hi up, cuckoo. Ask him if there's anything you need to do. Draw your weapon. 
His yeah, let's see. Is narrow. <laughs> the competition. Take out my competition, and I... A little magpie feather named Mog. He took over the other bridge across, and he's too cheap. I can't compete with his ridiculous <laughs> prices. Tell me you give, give him a location and see what you can do. Non-committal, but I Grog drags a rough map in the dust of the bridge with one claw. He then spends an inordinate amount of time sketching a highly vulgar doodle of this Marge. <laughs> now, for with this moment, quest, yeah, what's going on, Strawberry? Starberry lemonade. Nice. Where's the other bridge? Oh, it's all the way over there. All right, we can check it out. She Wait, so no more time for conversation. No more time. All right. That <laughs> rip red hair, Luis. <laughs> yeah, I changed it to black hair. She reminded me of, uh, what's her face from, um, Dragon Age, the, the woman. Using a similar part, right? Actually, just Bane instead of the Red Prince. I can see that. These are, like, the, the first three pit people that I picked up in the very beginning. Um, so I kind of just stuck with them after a little bit. This is my first playthrough, so like I'm still just getting used to everything as well. It's too late for them, whoever they were. All right, let's meet Marge. Life is. Oh, hello there. A fine day it is, and the finest day for a wee saunter through the trees it is too. Not even any void woke left to spoil it. So Marge that you met another troll recently, a troll by the name of Grog. Isn't a healthy business environment just wonderful? Grog and his next actor. Okay, nice. Give me just the little kick of competition I need to improve my service. Marge bats his eyelashes at you. You can't quite tell whether he's serious or not. Green, ask him how this fine day is treating him. Oh, just the best. Just the bee's knees, really. Oh I my made God. more money today than in the last month combined. Thanks to a group of magisters who were in such a hurry they didn't have time to haggle. Some sorcerer who fled by earlier. Huh. And she paid a handsome toll too. Glory, what a marvelous day. Draw your weapon and tell Marge that Grog sends his regards. Not a movie. Whoa, not so fast. <laughs> I, I do try to be nice about it and all that. But this bridge is Marge's business. Since it is such a fine day, I can let you pass at a discount if you entertain me with tales of valiant void woken battle. Otherwise, full price. Three gold versus five thousand. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Save the lost count of a woodwoken you slain recently. Try to recall your most memorable woodwoken fight. Wide-eyed, Marge nod. Now that is a story. For <laughs> that, you can One. pass repentance. Over you go, and be sure to appreciate the bewitching views as- Oh my god, this guy's too nice. Actually nice troll. He doesn't deserve to die like that. Man, I forgot to pay uh, that little unless I confused it with the other one. Dude, I can't kill Marge for that. The spirit doesn't register your presence at all. She rings I wish there was an indicator or something that, that was like, hey, this is, uh, oh, you just wait. Oh, great. Um, 
I wish that there was an indicator that I uh, like there was a ghost nearby or something and not just like whenever you always pay you got killed by the troll If there's an indicator, it'd be too easy. True. I guess so. Help us. Shush me. Don't you shush me, Geraldine. Shh. I know they're still here. You won't believe it. Truth is, kind sir, that we are not, in fact, cows. At least we're people. Captives, to be exact. Oh. Enslaved by the witch. Uh, you're not here to visit Alice. Il so will you help us? He won't help us. Look at him. Can barely help himself. <laughs> Yes, sir. Ask them for us. milk. <laughs> uh, how Just can we help? Something to drink. What my friend here means to say, kind sir, is that there's a cure for our condition. Is Alice Abyssin house? has it in her house. If we could drink it, we could then... Don't mention that. For God's sake, Geraldine. Dog rats. They're <laughs> Just ordinary rats. Nothing special or the witch ain't here. What my friend wishes to say is that Alice went into the cloisterwood collecting herbs and hasn't been seen in some time. But that there would you mind awfully procuring for us a small potion that Alice Elysian finds? See what I can I do. Humbly thank you. <laughs> Ordinary rats, hell assess. Actually though. Is this the house? Wait, what level are they? They're twelve, I guess. I mean, we're, we seem to be doing fine right now, so long as we don't get, like, attacked by a crazy amount of mobs. I'm just very cautious about my level and stuff. Oh. Which house? Oh my god, you're ugly. You turn Yo. milk green and a magister's red coat black. My mistress Alice might fancy you, though. She has a taste for the odd. Ochre on this map was a back. whiplash. Yeah. Uh, the that's what, I, with the red coats that's what I'm trying to figure to out. Like uh, where to head to. I'll be sorry. That way I'm at least like one level within the area. All I do know too is that I should be like level 17 technically by the time I leave here or so. Because I saw that the next area, or no, it's like 16. I was uh, under leveled up for a lot of act two, but I just got out of it. Got just, uh, I got out of it just fine. Okay. Here be witchery, trespass not. Their way into this house. Why do I feel like if I, uh, lockpick? Oh, God. Ugh, the stupid scarecrows, man. They spotted me. I ran into these guys way earlier, and I didn't fight them. So I guess we'll, we'll finally fight them. We'll give it a shot, at least. That's what I was afraid of. They were doing some heavy damage on me. The first time around at least. Let's see. I'm gonna move one spot forward. There's four of them too. No, there's five? Oh God, there is five. Uh oh, give it a shot. Oh, snap. <laughs> it actually did a lot of damage. I'll take it. I mean, I'll take that. If I knew that we were gonna get into a fight with them so early on too, I would have called this in first. But that's all right. Damn, 
I always forget that you can't do the level is your summoning. Uh, mine is like seven or eight. Maybe I can check. Oh yeah, I can upgrade too. Scales with your summoning level. Yeah, it's seven. Get your summoning to level 10. Trust me. Okay. <laughs> and we'll do intelligence. Actually, I want to get my constitution to 10. And then now intelligence. There we go. Okay, now we're definitely doing a lot of damage than the first time around. So I feel a little bit more confident with this. Nice. One down. I actually really like the music in this game. He's almost down. And he's crippled. Nice. Uh, I'll see. I'll do a fireball. Yeah, fireball towards him. That'll take him out. And then now, do this on that guy. And then, this on that. What the? Oh, it's, it's running. This is the fire. Right now, it's terrified. Scarecrow has an AOE de debuff. Oh, okay. I haven't used this ability yet. Turn one of them onto my side. Had a character with glass cannon talent, so this fight was bad for them. Okay, yeah, that's, see, I, I've always been one who, like, I can never accept the, the penalties for games that give you abilities that, like, potentially can be really good, because then I'm, o I'm always afraid I'm going to get absolutely wrecked. Um, when not having, like, the correct skills and stuff. I'm gonna put it on him. I will say this fight was hell for me. I don't know why. It was really bad for me the first time around. Like this is the second time that I ran into them. The first time I ran, so I was like, nope, not not even gonna try it. I can undo the buffs easily easily I like that I like that idea at least apparently I've also heard that weight or warfare um, affects your other characters or I mean your it affects your uh, incarnate is that true Ugh. I hate how you can't just run over this Actually, I might be able to. Wings. Ah. Uh, 
Oh, you have to be within two meters for that. Um, I guess we can do this. No, it's just summoning level. However, warfare does buff all physical damage your character does. Okay. That's what I thought. I was just confused. Like yesterday I watched a video that somebody was like, um, doing warfare and summoning affects your incarnate's physical damage. And I was like, wait, does it? Like, I feel like that's like a weird thing for it to do, but I wasn't sure if that was right or not. Why you'll see a lot of Necro warrior builds because Necro spells do physical damage. Uh, okay. So maybe I was getting it mixed up with um, uh, Necro, not Summoner. Nice. <laughs> they both got an attack opportunity. Warfare gets a couple of skills that can buff your incarnate. Okay. I can't reach the other guy. That ability is pretty good, so I'm going to move that down there. Only one left. Boom. Executed. Nice, nice. And everybody got some upgrades too. <laughs> My character's still flying. High quality torment sk skull. Leather scraps. Cool. Right, let's do that upgrade before we go inside here. Wait, is this is this uh, frog gonna yell at me if I lock pick it? I'm afraid that it's going to. Also, there's a rat in there. Wait, couldn't I te technically teleport too? All right, let's do some upgrades real quick. So, I uh, red prints here. Might as well take the extra five percent strength. And how's his memory looking? It's okay right now. Uh, wits critical damage. Yeah, let's take another strength. Then I feel like two handed is still doing really good for him. But then again, I have some very, very high uh, physical armor sh and shields that might be a, a lot better for him. Oh my God. Holy crap, it, that bumps everything up by so much. Yeah, yeah, definitely put that on him. Did you get the spider's kiss yet? Yes, I did. I got it on my character, though. <laughs> uh, right here, spider's kiss. All of your characters? Oh, really? Really? Wait. Oh, all of your characters can get it. Oh, my bad, my bad. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I thought that was a very interesting, interesting uh, one. 
Just keep talking to her with a different party member. Uh, gotcha. Huh. She would give each one the talent? Okay. Huh. Maybe I'll go back and do that for Los Losi. I don't know. Maybe I'll do Wayfair again. Physical attack steal. Yeah. Do that. Good old uh, Ethan and Ness. How's his memory looking? Basically full right now. Um. Yeah, yeah. I'll leave it as is. Do more finesse. Wait, he has summoning abilities? Oh, it's from gear, that's why. Uh, we're starting to do more poison stuff, so... I might do Geomancer again. And finally, Losi. How's her memory? Hers is fine. So we'll do intelligence, I think, for both. And the last two times, he's been using Geomancer a little bit more. Are these considered? Okay, so that's Hydro. Arrow, arrow. Oh, you can also see. Leo, Hydro. Only thing is, a lot of these are... Um... You don't have the talent yet, I rec recommend for your mages. Okay. Yeah, I don't have that yet for either of them, but I did see it a few times. Gives you three extra points in your memory attribute. I'm also starting to realize that specializing in like two or three skills at max is probably best because um, all of these, basically like all three of these, and then this one and this one uh, and this became available when I got to this area. And I know that there's going to be even more later on down the line. So I'm trying not to to have like too many at this rate. Um, there's enough for there isn't enough for three most of the time. Yeah. So that's why I'm trying to just keep it uh, within a certain realm uh i might go with feels 45 percent more damage sure let's bump that up to nine because i use that the most every time let's go to this real quick see if we can discover oh yeah we have some new armor too that we can throw on Hunters. I learned today that if you become an elf and then you eat some human flesh, you learn about the person that you just ate. <laughs> I never knew that. It's also slightly terrifying, but that's all right. Uh, whoops pull this back up okay so yeah i think i'm gonna take these for myself is this any better for anybody else uh yeah potentially and yes you could use that health how about this compared to that nah that's fine eating flesh in this game is fun too Elves and humans are the most powerful race. Eating flesh is fun. <laughs> Eating flesh is fun. Eating flesh is fun in this game too. I see what you did there. I feel like I get so many good uh, shields, but I never use them. 
Else get stab themselves. Elves get to stab themselves for one additional AP. Not bad. Feel like that can be pretty useful. Damn. The big upgrade. Uh kinda. I don't think anybody else has strength eleven. Yeah. I also need to keep making sure that I equip items. I, I keep forgetting that you can equip stuff that's uh like I have something in here that's like level 15 or so. But it doesn't really tell you that if you equip something with that, I uh, that you're gonna lose a lot of uh, stats. Like this, I think it was this this bow here. Oh no, it's this one's a level eleven. I had a, a bow or a sword that was literally um, it was like fifteen or so. Manage runes. Let's do that. Oh shoot. Okay. That's good. Hunters. Finesse 12. I think he's the only one that would be able to wear them. And it's level 11. Yeah. These are Finesse 12 as well, right? Yeah. Okay. Not bad. Quick save. All right, let's see if we can get inside here. I'm gonna try a different strat like this. Maybe not, maybe not. Okay, guess that's not gonna work. Squeak. I'm also running into the issue where I can't really uh, open some doors anymore because my thievery is not high enough i can't lock pick certain things uh hmm Thievery too low. Yep, there it is. What am I supposed to do? I mean, I can come back. I know where this is at, and I know this area is like level 11. I think this is all like level 12 and stuff, and then this is like higher, 13 or 14 or so, I think. Yeah, I think I might go to the right. I could always attack the door and just break it down but I don't know if I want to be that mean. Difficult squirrel cows. Oh God. Wait, why did it just, it becomes nighttime when you get right here. It's funny. By Lucian's sword, we meet. Wait, that's the guy from the original. The magisters place. are out there on the blasted heath hunt. Oh. Uh, choose myself again. The spirit mouths the word. I shall not mourn till all is done. Oh, my dear, and now she turns back to her fallen self once more. I'll hold my a weary paladin. Oh, pity you just arrived. We could have used adventurers like you in that last fight. We're short-handed, deserters. If you can believe Scarecrow. that. Scarecrow fight. And I teleported. Their post and wandered off into the Scarecrow all the way to the paladin base and had them to do all the work for me. That's funny. 
That's actually pretty cool too. Uh, so there's, if you can believe that, men in their prison wandered off in the wasteland and left their friends to die. It's shameful. But that sometimes even the most loyal person must take their own path. Uh, uh, yeah, we think alike, you and I. Uh, no. I'm just gonna say that just because it makes them happy. Sighting a stocky paladin. This one I remember. Hardwin and I served together back in the war. Let me do the talking. The two men embrace amicably enough, but you sense an uneasy tension running beneath. Well, as I live and scarcely breathe, if it isn't Ivan Ben Mezd. I thought you died in the death fog. I thought you died a hero. But I suppose it's better to live as one. We really gave those Black Ring what for, eh? Wiped them all out in the blink of an eye. Damned proud to have served with you, Ben. Ifan's face turns sour as he mutters something under his breath that only the paladin can hear. Hardwin loses all camaraderie and blanches, stepping backwards. He puts one. You. You've changed. And for the worse. I'll not have the sacrifices of my fallen brothers maligned to my face. You survived, Ben Mester. Be thankful for that, if nothing else. Okay. I mean, I guess we can just pass by, but... The paladin sends arrow after arrow into the trees. She whips her head and fixes... They're coming. That, my friend, depends on your definition of... She turns back to the forest. I guess I can be okay with that. Uh oh, the game just quick saved. Ah, uh, wait, there's a body. They we showed them. Yes, we did. We showed them how to die. Uh, not gravely. He certainly did show the enemy how we'll to die. Yet, we'll win. What? We'll win this war yet. Uh, I guess we'll go south from here. Wow, that's weird. It just went from being rainy to sunny. Oh God. Are you ready? Now it's raining again. And it's dark, but then when we walk right here, it's sunny again. Oh, something uh, sinister is going on. Whoa. The dead here stir. I hear their whispers. Oh, Tarquin. Workers come. Oh, but you do get around, don't you? He takes a satisfied sniff and rubs his hands together. His lip. When it comes to graveyards, I'm a kid in a candy shop. All sorts of oh, goodies weird? and gewgaws for the taking. And a bit of rousing conversation. If you know what to dig, that is. Says he stop being so coy. You know he's a necromancer. It couldn't be more obvious. Coy? Why, I don't know what you mean, Hanson. I must. He presses a forefinger against his. You're a savvy one. I must confess. It's okay, same. I'm not just here for random baubles and whatnot. There's something my heart, such as it is, is set on. Well, Pray that's tell. a gold-plated question it is. I dare say you'll... Somewhere in this graveyard lies an object of tremendous power. Or so the legends say, anyway. The Infinity Stones. Long to family buried near here. The Surreys. I've been reading up on them. An ancient clan of eccentrics and oddballs. Fascinating people. Old Joanna was the last. The poor, poor, poor dear. Problem is, no one knows what this object is. Only that it's an astounding piece of work. Seems Joanna took its secrets to her grave. Rather literally. Hmm. His coy grin. I can recite each page from memory. But I... Tarquin sighs and his lips... It pains me to say... But you've talents in the adventuring department that I do not. This heirloom could prove valuable. You're still unclear on why you need this one. Looks broken. Grill him. He seriously knows nothing more about this thing he wants to find. Yeah, we'll look out for it. 
The Surrey too must be somewhere near. He looks toward the grave. I do wish I could wander inside. It would be nice to look up some. <laughs> Let's see what spirits form this gun. Is as blank as a silent moon. at first glance the spirit seems much like its host oh. hollow detached yet in its eyes you see something more ominous something not apparent before agony the spirit nods and its face grows even more tortured this spirits as haunted as the graveyard it roams why does it have that thing about this masked creature is mute Kingdom. Well now, oh. how's my favorite oh god. god woken? Uh, until... His eyes glitter. So, underneath the tavern in Driftwood, there's a place I feel right at home. A delightful little hive of scum and villainy. All of a sudden, a tiger prowls in. I jump up, but everyone else is just ignoring it. And then, he picks up my... I flip the table and start scrambling for my crossbow. Nowhere to be found, and by now, the tiger's right on top of my eyeballs. So I do the only thing I can think of. And now everybody reacts. Screaming, scrambling around, pelting. Turns out, turns out it was Drudene messing with me. <laughs> Stronger stuff than I'm used to. Also turns out, well, but he's a real sweetheart once you get to know him. I love that. If Anne claps you on the... Locked in perpetual prayer. Keep trying, my friend. Waypoint discover. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Oh. Chat with this one. Oh, God. The spirit does not respond to your presence. The statue gestures to the graveyard's... Rare to see her likeness outside of the dwarven halls. Dwarves leave their dead for the birds to consume. How barbaric. We died. Two dwarven spirits <laughs> at loggerheads. In a flash, you are both of them, brother and sister. Your feminine side is a rebel, rising up against the terrain. As the brother, you rescue your sister from the pikes of the royal guard. Together, you flee across the sea to the melting pot of Driftwood and Reaper's Coast. You are the sister. And you know that something is wrong. You climb the stairs to rescue your brother and find him fighting for his life against the dwarves who would rob him. Both of you die, but your killers do right by their fellow dwarves and bring you here to lay you to rest. As spirits, you fight for eternity. One convinced that the queen is a tyrant, the other that your treason was wrong. <laughs> Sign with the brother. Brother, the rebellion was a terrible mistake. Sign with the sister. You have to stand up for what you believe in. The sister smiles. She feels vindicated. Her brother still does not agree. The rebellion was a disaster. The rebellion was a mistake. The Oof. Watching the birds pick your body clean, and it means that elf ain't getting his claws on my coat. Not mine specifically, but he creeps from grave to sepulchre, take him up. A grim expression passes across her face as she- The dead don't rest easy in this garden. Not by half. He lives in the big house by the gate. I ain't about to wonder the less I see of him. We were hmm. picked off by spies. There was no glory and no point to it either. We are right. an inspiration to our people. Silenced spirit. So I'm guessing there's a way that you can clear the silence. Within the stone garden's walls, peace be thy immortal fortune. Relieved of toil, free of indignity, until thou calls to save.
As you reach to push open the heavy door, the coils and whirls of engraved wood dance into a new pattern. The same A little sorcerer. You are a sorcerer, are you not? Perhaps even Godwoken? Tell me true, now. Silence greets your answer. In the distance, you hear the screech of an eagle. Worryingly closer, you hear some kind of a moan. Time passes. At last, the lips on the door creak open, and the door speaks. Enter. The face melts back into the wood of the door, and the world... Quick save, just in case. <laughs> All right. Who builds a mansion on the edge of a graveyard? A very kind man. The spirit does not respond. Uh. Oh. Riker. A visitor? Such a rare and... The elf tilts his head backwards. But his squinted eyes don't stray from call me Riker. Please do avail yourself of my creature comforts. You've surely come a long way. What about this uh, graveyard mansion? It's not an ordinary location, I admit. But I prefer to be extraordinary. Extra there is no pleasure ordinary. in mediocrity. Don't so, you agree? Sure. God welcome. I know you're a god woken. Don't be so naive. My doors only open on the occasion of truth. What do you admit? I also see you on. He presses a slender forefinger against his titan. Mm. I'm not a generous man, but I could give you what you seek if you offer something in return. <clears throat> a completely fair exchange between sorcerers. Let's not be so secretive, my good fellow. You're dying to show off those smoldering... I can help you with that. I can share my bond with the source with you. Fill your well to the brim. Make you a master. The rest of the story, well, it's <laughs> yours to write. You must go to the Black Pits. There's a cavern there. In it, you'll find a... He points to the location on your... Bring it. To Dizziness. It lasts just a moment, but long enough for you to feel Ralik's presence. You hear no words, yet understand. It's imperative you accept Riker. The episode passes. Riker is peering at you intently. He awaits your reply. Huh. Uh, wonder why he doesn't just get it himself, ask it what the tablet does, promise it will be done. A promise you'd best fulfill. Riker bows his head. Then you'll have the power you seek, if not the power that trumps it. There will now please Okay. <laughs> Wait, what's the. Is my objective what about, like, possibly killing him? Find the surveillance family crypt. Generous offer. Investigate the black pits. Midnight oil. Murder march of the troll. Find the fugitive witch. Alright. Surrey crypt. Black pits. Black Pit's cave. Okay. Cool. Well, we definitely don't want to steal anything. Check upstairs. Death there. crawls above. Ascend only if you seek it. God. Our globes they glide over flats and sharps. Whither go they, Lord of Life? Direct them. Wizards and young divinity. The echoes of a distant path. Ooh. All right, I guess we're good inside here. So we need a. Surrey, uh, yeah, let's go to the Surrey one first, I guess. That's like one of the closer ones. Right. Here lies Farron Daughter of Roland and Prudence. 
sister to Amelia, Carlin, and Niles, died of an unexplained illness. Come on, mistress. Hear me. Zimski mutters to himself as he places sigils in the dirt. <laughs> he spies heads or tails. Ah, uh, tails. He flips the coin high in the air. It twinkles beneath the moonlight as Lucky. Enjoy it while you can. All my life I served Lady Luck and see how it ends. In the Turning from you, he crouches back to the dirt. He resumes tracing esoteric sigils, his fingertips swirling through the graveyard clay. Uh, signs to call. Oh, Lady Luck always came when I called. For 30 years we roamed Riverlon together. She was now, I cannot influence even a coin toss. But you breathe. I'll wager you more use for my gifts than I do. Here, tell me what you truly value. If my lady sees fit, I'll give you what I truly value in return. Oh man. Uh, is he value? State that you're winning is what you value most of all. And in vain you've read, you've read that this lady luck is no more than a demon in disguise. Good enough. He smiles a foxy smile. Did the mystic one like fingers at your chest. He begins to trace sigils on your flesh. Though you cannot feel his fingers upon your skin, something inside you shifts. You feel a coldness, and a sick longing seeps into your heart. He croons incantations. Ah, now you feel a touch. Now Lady Luck sings in your blood as she once did in mine. And that Whoa. He prays in silence. But to what god, I wonder? Uh, is it bad if we break in? Wait, there's a... Oh, there's a... Oh, wait, no, it's a mass servant. Can we use this ability again? Mass service does not. One second. Uh, okay. Let's see if we can get inside here. Uh, and try lock picking. I don't know if our lock picking skill is going to be high enough though. Oop, thievery too low. Yeah. Like we need it. That's, that's one of the things I need to upgrade then. An ancestor. 
Even I can't deny the beauty. Oh. The spirit ignores your presence. Could have just fast traveled back. Oh, wait. Let's try speaking to the spirit. I've spotted some. You there! Help me, please! What's some matter? thoughtless fool buried me in this grave to be left as fodder for <laughs> I the I like world. how they always do this. I can't be at peace in a place like this. The hands from left to, to right. To rest according to lizard tradition. <laughs> it's always the lizards that do them. The eternal fire burns in the lizard quarter of the cemetery. I beg you, cast my remains into the fire. Set my spirit free. Ah, I should have known your kind would. <laughs> What's in it for me? These must be the remains of that lizard spirit, just as he said. All right, so he said cast it into the living fire. That was right here. Oh, this part is gated off from the rest. Whoever is buried here must have been important. Nobody here to talk to. Here rests the dwarven hero. Here rests the lizard hero. Hmm. Secret unlock. Secret unlock. Here rests the human hero Garrick. He served Lucy and the Divine with immense skill. A uh, Garrick. Here rests the elven hero Halla. He suddenly Halla. the earth churns. God Wogan, you must fall. The God King demands you must fall. So let your blood quench our roots, so we may grow. The covenant shall be full. Oh God. Haste steel, God Wogan. Heroes rest. The eternal promise. Let's try this. <laughs> ah, what? <laughs> oh my god. I got Wrecked. <laughs> One down. Wait a minute, what? Wait, do you have to kill them all like at the same time? Uh-oh. Hold up. Wait a minute. They came back to kill each one twice? Oh, okay. death for 
really trying to get that bonus. From up top. Should avoid using poison against undead enemies, by the way, they heal off of it. True, I forgot about that. Right, right, right. Ah, oh, damn. Cost one AP to get up here. <laughs> nice. One down. Yeah, go invisible. Do I have soulmate right now? This one. Immune to bleeding. I should have just did like regular attacks on them instead. Uh, this should work. One down. Another one down. Another one. Path interrupted. No. I never found use for a chicken claw, honestly. Yeah, I'm starting to think that too, to be honest. I thought it was a cool ability at first, but like now it's kind of like, eh, yeah, it's not really doing much. Plus you have to, it, it, you have to be two meters from them too, which isn't great either. See if we can take him out with this hit. Executed. <laughs> nice. I'm 
What's this covenant? Wait, what? Oh, Garrick's back. Because that's the first one that we... Oh, man. <laughs> he was the only one that I didn't kill twice. What are stunning and freezing everyone anyway? Why would I need it? True. Baited. <laughs> it's okay. Maybe I can do two hits. Ah, damn. That would have been cool. Elemental totem. Put one right there. There it is. <laughs> now we got it. Everyone wants to talk? The heroes of Driftwood lie at your feet. Dead for good this time. If they can be corrupted, maybe we can too. Far be from... They're truly what passes for heroes in this world. When did heroes turn villains? And what is this covenant? Whatever this covenant is, it didn't bring them victory. Whoever is behind all this will have to try harder if they want to stop us. Haha. -ha. Funny because that was all on the way of trying to do this. My quick save. Is that what he wanted? Right? I mean, it's in the fire. Oh, there it goes. You have done me a great oh, it had to go further into the fire. Now, <laughs> the Hall of Echoes. Nice. Uh, yeah, we'll take Poison Arrow. That's fine. Garrick's buried valuables. Oh. The plinth of the statue bears a series of deep circular scrolls. The statue rotates with little resistance. The plinth of the statue bears a You cringe at the sound of stone grating. You cringe at the sound. You cringe at the You cringe. In... The sculpture looks impossible. The sculpture looks. You cringe. The statue wrote. Uh. I've spotted something. The headless statue looms over you. It's pl the statue doesn't. Broken angelic statue. Oh God. Also, Thur, thank you for the follow. There, appreciate it. Killing those heroes also spawns loot on the map. They were pretty good, I think. Okay. Uh. Does anyone know how to fix this? The headless statue looms over you. The plinth of the statue. The statue rotates. I'm feeling they have to face each other or something. Or either face out. That one's facing away. Uh, 
Oh, I see. Derek's buried, buried valuables. All right, we'll come back to that. There's a broken head some, somewhere in that graveyard. Okay. Ooh. Piece of candy. It's close, but I don't remember exactly where it's at. We are uh, discovering all of this right now. <laughs> okay, so now level 12 item. Level 12. Level 12. 11. Here's one. Here's one that I can actually use. Uh, Diviner hands. Oh, it's literally the same exact gloves I'm currently wearing. Intelligence. Uh, it's a little bit better, kind of. How about hers? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, strength 12. Let's see. Oh yeah. Physical. And uh, yeah, his current two sword axe is a lot better. Sapphire ring. Geomancer and summoning. Might be good for me. Oh, yeah. Replace the fancy ring. Boom. Then. Who would like this one? Wayfair. Uh, summoning. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Get rid of that. Number two ring. I uh, okay, that's level 12 and that's level 12 as well and nobody's level 12 yet Oh God, what is going on? We have to save them. How do we get down there? Oh God, this looks like a mess. Also, what level are they? This guy, he's level 13. What's that? Sounds like there's a battle unfolding. There's some, uh, Of an apple pie. Got to come up with something. Can't keep her locked up forever. Whoa, what? A man paces back and forth, puffing anxiously. Danger to pie. herself and his face and is others. with tiredness. The faint coppery hue of dried blood stains it. If you're looking for healing or the like, then you'd best look elsewhere. My, my plate is full for now. The man chomps on the bit of his pipe. I came by a new patient, a young woman, very troubled. I'll do what I can for her, but I'll need to concentrate. And that means... <laughs> he gestures with his pipe for you to leave. Say that you have knowledge of feeling and offer right. help. Fine. You can help. Just... Be... Okay.
Across <laughs> the cellar, a shape bearing some resemblance to a woman lurches around to... She senses us. Be calm and quiet. No sudden moves. You're right. I hadn't noticed before. Couldn't get close enough. We have to help her. Maybe we can reverse whatever was done to her. All right. We need her subdued, understand? Do whatever you can to... Another gurgle. Sharper, angrier. Then the sound of rapid footfall. Oh, good God. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> Uh, I think we got this, so I'm hoping. I mean, they're only level 12 and they're, we're level 11. Once we get that physical damage down, they, they, it seems like they go down quick. Back, did I miss anything? Uh, not much, I don't think. Do we take down the memories first or take down her first? I left for 40 minutes and we've been going beating up cows to fighting demons. True. <laughs> it does seem to be the way that this game goes. Don't kill her. Oh, a danger to herself and others. Oh, she's dead. Sorry, bro. Um, uh oh. Wait, did that just archive it? Danger to herself and others. Sick human attacked us. Swan still study or remains to find out what ailed her. 
Uh, where'd he go? Oh, here he is. Poor thing. Dead before. He fishes out his pipe and tries to spark it alight with some flint. His tr to hell with the gods. I'm going to see what I can learn from this poor girl before I... Well... He rolls up his sleeves. Only one way to find out. <laughs> I'm sorry. We failed you. I don't know if they're even... I'm assuming... Well, with this game being as big as it is, I'm assuming that there is a way that you can um, find out or, or save her or something. Maybe I should have blessed her. I don't know. But, I mean, it looks like he wants me to come back at some point, so. Uh, da -da -da. Black pits. Okay. So, in order to get there, we have to go up here. Right? I don't see any other route or potential route right now. Rex. Wait, Rex, come here. Ah, same. Same. Uh, let me do a full save too, actually. Alright, chat, hold on one second. I'm gonna run to the bathroom real quick and then we'll continue. So, BRB.